Hello and welcome to another round of the Dunlop MSA Formula Ford Championship of Great Britain. We've already seen the cars out racing, but with such complicated machinery, how is it checked that nobody has taken advantage of the rules? Nigel Jones is the chief scrutineer for the championship and it's his job to make sure that the rules are followed and to check cars for any problems. All cars that are going to a race are subject to scrutineering, but what exactly does a scrutineer do? Basically my role is to make sure that all the cars comply with the technical regulations. Um, we do all the measurements and bits and pieces like that, check that the, the cars meet the, the regulations that we've, we've made. The safety side of things are done uh, before the cars go out. They're minimum checks that make sure that the car is actually safe to go out. And my function is to check that the cars comply once they've completed their qualifying and each his respective race. As well as checking that the cars meet the guideline rules, it's also the scrutineer's job to check that the car is in a safe state to take to the racetrack. I don't have anything in mind before the race starts um, and during the race we'll decide what we're going to do. We'll always weigh the cars to make sure they meet the minimum weight of the car and the minimum weight of the car and driver. We will also look at the ECU, at the various parameters that, from the engine and also that all of the mandatory sensors are actually operational. The telemetry from each car is also downloaded and analysed. We plug the laptop into the car uh, using the diagnostic connector and then we download all the data from the engine management system on the car which we can then look at afterwards, A to check to see if there's no issues with the engine and B as part of the scrutineering role which I perform, make sure they're not fiddling with any of the parameters they shouldn't be fiddling with and that way we try and keep the uh, competition as close as we can. For each lap I can see what the engine temperature is, how fast the engine's going, how much throttle the driver's applied, what the boost pressure is, what the oil temperature is, what the oil pressure is, battery voltage, just the various parameters associated with the engine management system and how it performs. Engines are sealed at the race meetings by the scrutineers. We seal the engines at the beginning of the season for two reasons. The first reason is to identify that that engine is in that car. Should the team wish to change the engine, we know that the one that they have removed, we have a seal on it and we know that that can't be touched. We would seal the one that replaces it and if it's halfway through the season and the leading car wants to change it, it gives us the prerogative to be able to strip the engine to inspect it to make sure that all of the components meet the dimensions and weights as laid down in the technical regulations. At the end of each race, the cars are weighed and fluid samples taken. Uh, we may take some fuel samples, um, which are either done on site or we will send them away to the laboratory to be checked. Um, or we will do just the basic measurements um, with the facilities that we have. So there certainly are a lot of tests the cars undergo to ensure there's an even playing field. And with all the cars running to the same regulations, the Dunlop MSA Formula Ford Championship of Great Britain is one of the closest and most entertaining race series.